What's up, everyone? This is a weird spur of the moment impromptu live stream because I was sent some news by the guys over at expandeduniverse.com on Twitter that a legacy expanded universe novel is being released and it's out there right now on Amazon. I will put the link in the chat, but go grab it while you can. This book was written many years ago by Kenneth Flint, I believe his name is. We'll go over an article by I think it's StarWarsTimeline.com about what the book's about. It happened shortly after the truce at Bacora, but get out there and buy it while you can. This particular article from ExpandedUniverse.com that I'm going to put in the chat has the link to the Amazon site where you can purchase the book. And I've already bought several copies myself. Let's see if it actually ships to us. I'm very hopeful that it will. So thanks again to the guys at ExpandedUniverse.com, uh, Joe Bongiorno and Matt Wilkins and all them for sending this to me because they know that I have a little bit of reach when it comes to EU stuff. So let me go ahead and share my screen and we can talk about what this book is about. Mm -mm -mm, let me find the right one here. Here it is. So it's from StarWarsTimeline.net. They have a lot of stuff that never got published, a lot of lost novels and comics. So go check them out sometime. But it says, here's the cover, by the way. That looks like one of those vintage EU novel covers, and I love it. The font's correct and everything. It says, this long-lost novel, commissioned and approved by Lucasfilm, is set to be released in 1993. Disappeared without a trace. For many years, fans wondered what became of the book and why it was never published. And so it was chalked up to yet another tragic Lost World story that no one would ever get to read or enjoy. Or so we thought. Kenneth C. Flint's complete novel, The Heart of the Jedi, has at last been unearthed. Published here in four-chapter installments, this is, it has been edited to fit into the ex existing expanded universe, taking place a short time after the truce at Bakura, and the end of issue 107 of the Marvel series. They're talking about the original real Star Wars Marvel series, which I happen to love myself, but before the X-Wing comic book series. For a biography of the author, click here, blah, blah, blah. So, you know, it's it's been published out here on this website, but this is a chance to get it in a paperback format. Let's hope it actually arrives, but I am pretty excited about it. And it's a great piece of news to get on a Friday, to be quite honest. Um, thanks for showing up, Legends. I hope you go out there and buy it yourself. So yeah, this is awesome news. If you're watching this, it's out there. You can buy it right now, but get it while you can. That is my advice. That's everyone's advice. I believe Ryan Kennel has already bought several copies himself. Because let me tell you what, these are going to be worth money once they're gone whether or not it was officially published or not. This is a story that was commissioned and written by an author by the Legacy Lucasfilm, Lucas Licensing Company. So go check it out. I think that'll be it now, but I just wanted to get the word out that this book is out there. So go check it out. The link is in the chat. I will put it in the description eventually once this video gets uploaded, once this live stream gets uploaded. So thanks for tuning in and thanks for watching this on replay and we will catch you later.